Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. Today, find out how the price of EOS has changed and what the technical indicators EMA, Divergence, Stochastic RSI and MACD show. If you are unfamiliar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos below. Looking at the EOS hourly time frame, the price moved down with around 3.9% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 3.03. The volume was actually high showing that this move was strong and the sellers are taking over. Jumping to the hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is below the hourly ribbon, which is generally bearish and the ribbon could play as a resistance, so it is to watch if the price will bounce off it or break it. The current price to watch is around 3.18. The resistance should be considered because the ribbon is more or less spread out. Searching for divergence in the hourly time frame, the price has already gone up owing to the last bullish divergence. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are located in the higher region. This means that the price is high due to overbuying and a change in the trend, or at least some kind of consolidation, can be expected. The K line is currently located below the D line, meaning that there is a downwards trend. Jumping to the hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the downside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate and it is better to wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bearish. Looking at the three hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is below the three hourly ribbon, which is generally bearish and the ribbon could play as a resistance, so it is to watch if the price will bounce off it or break it. The current price to watch is around 3.53. The ribbon is spread out so the resistance should be strong. Jumping to the three hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are located in the higher region. This means that the price is high due to overbuying and a change in the trend, or at least some kind of consolidation, can be expected. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so you should wait to see if the trend will actually go down. Moving to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. Looking at the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is strong at the moment and we can expect the price to continue growing or maybe at least remaining the same for some time. Jumping to the daily exponential moving averages, the price at the moment is, is situated below the daily ribbon, which is usually bearish and the ribbon can act as a resistance, so you should keep an eye on if the price will break it or bounce of it. The current price to watch is around 4.26. The ribbon is relatively spread out so the resistance should be considered. Moving to the daily stochastic RSI, the crypto is being oversold because both the percent %K and percent %D lines are currently very low. This means that we can expect a change in the trend or for the crypto can remain at least stable for some time. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so you should wait to see if the trend will actually change to the upside. Moving to the daily MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently strong and it could be expected the price to go further to the downside. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.